Hello everyone and welcome. Today, I'm going to be giving a full walkthrough of Everfit's client app and web platform. Starting here on the client app, as you can see, it is broken up into five tabs. Across the bottom there is the today page, the coaching page, the inbox, the on-demand, and the you. Starting here on the today page, if you have any announcements for your clients, that will be the very first thing they see when they open the app, and then they can see their workout for the day. Here, when they hit start workout, they will see a list of every exercise then they can go ahead and get started. Right under the title, there's a couple different icons they can choose from. The first one on the left is gonna be workout history, so the clients can see all the past times they've completed this exercise. The clients can leave comments on this exercise. They can add exercises before or after, and they can add sets or replace exercises as well. To complete a set, they just hit the check mark on the right and an automatic rest timer will come up for them. If they want, they can always adjust the weights and reps for each exercise as well. When they've gone through each exercise, they can start to complete. They will get a little congratulations and the clients can leave feedback on how difficult they found the workout. Right under the workout will be any task you assign to them. They can simply check these off and complete their task for the day. Then any habit you assign will show up next. Here, they can go in, fill out these habits. They will get insights like current streaks, best streaks, daily averages, and the clients can leave comments on the habits too. For the step tracker, we have integrations with Apple Health, Google Fit, Fitbit, Garmin, and Aura that your clients can connect. And with the daily calories, we have integrations with MyFitnessPal and Chronometer. The food journal is where clients can post pictures of their meals if they like to. And the today's meals will be any meal plan you assign to your clients. So they can go in, if they want to log the meal, they can do that with however many servings they've eaten, and it will track the macros and calories. You can also assign recipe books for your clients. We're here, your clients can add the recipes to the meal planner super easily. The last thing on the today page will be the community forums. Here is where all your clients can interact with each other, make posts, and like and comment on each other's posts. With the coaching tab, up top on the weekly view, is where your clients can see their workouts for the week. If they hit that square in the top right made out of arrows, they can move workouts from day to day on their own calendar. And on this page is a lot of compliance data, so they can track how they've been doing throughout the week with everything they've been assigned. With the inbox, it's like a texting feature. So you and the clients can send messages, gifts, pictures and videos, and you can have group chats in the inbox as well. With the on-demand section, is where you can provide additional resources, workouts, or programs for your clients. So here, they can access anything you've assigned to them with these folders. And on the U page in the bottom right, so where your clients can track any of their metrics, see active history, exercises, progress photos. In the top right in the settings, with the app integrations, is where they can connect any one of those wearables or the macro trackers. Full walkthrough of the Everfit platform. First, I'm going to start here on the Clients tab and show you how you can add clients onto the platform. So here, when you click Add Client in the top right, you can enter their information and advise them through their email. If you want, you can add multiple clients at the same time. You can also add clients through a CSV file as well. Along with that, you will have a custom invite link down here in the bottom left that you can send out and clients can create their own account and sign up that way as well. When you are on a client's account, the first tab you'll see is the overview. Here, you can see a snapshot of everything going on with this client. So you can see any training, body metrics, goals, habits, notes, injuries, progress photos, or any live updates. With the training tab is where you can see any workouts or programs you designed to this client. So here you can move workouts on the client's calendar, adjust individual exercises and copy and paste workouts, as well as copy and pasting whole weeks. With the tasks, you can assign a couple different types. First one will be a general task where you give it a name. You can add media, documents, or links. Set reminders for these tasks and you can have these tasks repeat however often you would like. 
You can have a task for the client to update their progress photos, update any body metrics. You can build forms of questionnaires and assign it to a task, and you can assign daily habits as well. So here, you can choose from our list of habits or create your own custom habit. For the body metrics, we do have integrations with Apple Health, Google Fit, Fitbit, Garmin, and Aura. And here, those apps will automatically track your client's steps, weight, body fat, heart rate, and sleep performance. You can also assign any manual metric you would like your clients to keep track of as well. With the exercise metrics, every time your client completes a workout, it will save, so you can always go back in time and track their progress. With the food journal, your clients can post pictures of their meals and you can like and comment on it. With the macros, we do have integrations with MyFitnessPal and Chronometer, so your clients can log their foods in one of those two apps and you can see the macro and calorie breakdown on our platform. You can set their macro and calorie goals, add rest day macros, and add macros for specific days of the week as well. With the meal plan feature, you can create meal plans and assign them to your clients on a weekly basis. And when your clients log their completion of these meals, it will also keep track of their macros and calories. In the settings, it is very customizable. So you can turn the settings on or off for each client individually. You can control your client's view of their program, allow clients to move workouts around their own calendar, and provide your clients with a list of workouts they can swap out during their workouts as well. In the library is where you can manage all of your exercises, workouts, programs, and meal plans. With the exercises, we do have over 3,000 you can choose from, and you can also add your own if you want to, where you give it a name, primary focus, some instructions, and you can upload your own video. When you're building workouts, you can go ahead and click Add New Workout. So here, let's say I want to build a leg day. You can look for exercises by typing them in. And you can drag and drop. You can also filter. So if you want to filter by primary focus, you can do that as well. Here you can enter the weight. You can do rep ranges, add rest times, different sets superset exercises, and you can add alternate workouts too. Along with that manual way of putting, to, putting together workouts, we also have AI introduced to the platform. With this AI, you can copy and paste any text into our AI workout builder, and it will generate the whole entire workout for you. And you can then easily assign to a client or put into a program. When you want to build a program, you can go in here. And again, in the top right, click add new program. You give it a title and set it for however long you want. And you can go ahead and add those workouts onto the calendar. So here I am choosing from that list in my workout library. If you want to repeat these workouts, you can copy a full week, paste it in. Then you can assign all four weeks of workouts to the clients right here, and you can assign it to multiple clients at the same time. For the recipes and meal plans, we do have over 500 recipes you can choose from on the platform. You can create your own custom recipes. And we also have AI for recipe builder. So here you can copy and paste any URL or any text. And again, it will generate that recipe. So here it's going through reading that URL and it's going to automatically input all of the ingredients, all of the instructions, everything included in that recipe, as well as all the macronutrients involved as well. So then you can easily take these, put them into meal plans, or put them into recipe books and assign them to your clients with ease. And your clients can log all of these foods straight in our platform. So here, all of the information is automatically inputted with the cooking instructions and all the nutritional info as well. Here with the inbox is where you can directly communicate with your clients. So you and the clients can send messages, GIFs, voice notes, and pictures and videos. You can create group chats within the inbox. You can also broadcast messages. So here, if you wanted to send a blast message out to all of your clients, we have these variables, so it will look nice and personal for the clients, and it gets sent out to them each individually, but you're just sending this as a blast message. 
Here with the automation, there are two main features. First one is going to be the auto flow. The auto flow allows you to input every single piece of a program onto one calendar and then add as many clients as you want onto that calendar. So here you can put in all the workouts for a full program. You can put in all of the tasks and habits and forms and questionnaires, and you can have messages scheduled to go out at certain points. With the messaging, there are two different types. One will be an announcement. This will be the very first thing your client sees when they open the app for the day, where you can have a written message, images, videos, or links. You can also have an in-app message that will go straight to the client's inbox. And here we have these variables that will enter the client's first name, so it looks nice and personal for the clients. Then you can add as many clients as you want onto this calendar. So if you add 20 clients in here, all 20 clients will receive these workouts. They will all receive these tasks and they will all receive these messages on the day they're supposed to. With the onboarding flow, it's there to help automate the onboarding process for all your clients. So here you can preset any content you want the clients to receive the very first time they log in. So you can have some forms automatically sent to their account. You can have them receive a welcome message. You can have them join a program, a community forum, receive any on-demand content or join an autoflow as well. With our on-demand section, there are three main features. The resource collections, workout collections, and studio programs. With the resources, you can add any links, documents, or forms. And you can take any of these resources and categorize them into separate collections. Once you add the resources into a collection, you can then share these collections full of content with your clients, and the clients will always have access to that information. And the on-demand workouts kind of work the same way. You can add workouts you've built on Everfit, or get workouts from YouTube or Vimeo. Then again, categorize them into collections and share collections full of workouts with the clients for them to always have on the app and they can complete whenever they want to. Right. With the studio programs, you would build these out the same way as you would build a normal program. The difference here is one client can have access to all three of these programs and the client has full control over when they want to do the programs and how quickly they want to complete them. So the client can manually start this two week program they can pause it if they want to, come back a week later and pick it up where they left off. Once they finish it, they can go ahead and start the demo program whenever they want to. When they finish the demo, they can start the yoga program all in their own time. With the community forums, it's a way for all of your clients to interact with each other. So here, they can all make posts, they can like and comment on each other's posts, they can post photos and videos. You as the host can pin posts to the top of the page and also create polls. You can also create multiple community forums if you have different groups of clients. With our payment package system, it makes it super easy to sell all of your programs and input new clients into your platform. How it works is there are sequences and you put those sequences inside of a package. The sequences are what you want to sell. So here, for example, if I wanted to sell a six week training program, I'll add that to this sequence. When you create a package, you would include that sequence, set a price, and each package has its own custom link. Whenever a client goes through that link and makes a purchase, they will automatically have access to that program you put in when they log into the app. If you want to add teammates onto the platform, it is really easy to do so. You just enter their information and invite them through their email. If you set their role as an admin, they can see every client on the platform and all what all the clients are working on. If you set their role as a trainer, they can only see the clients they are working with specifically. With our advanced branding, you can change any color of the client app, the splash screen, the picture behind each workout, the icon inside the app, the app icon on the client's phone, and you can have a custom welcome video for them as well.